March 7, Thursday after Ash Wednesday A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke Jesus said to his disciples, The Son of Man must suffer greatly and be rejected by the elders, the chief priests, and the scribes, and be killed, and on the third day be raised. Then he said to all, If anyone wishes to come after me, he must deny himself and take up his cross daily and follow me. For whoever wishes to save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. What profit is there for one to gain the whole world, yet lose or forfeit himself? The Gospel of the Lord Must suffer greatly and be rejected. Jesus is aware that despite all the good he is doing, many cannot accept him, even hate him, and seek his life. He knows that ultimately he will give up his life, and those who want to follow him should be ready to experience the same. But on the other hand, Jesus makes it clear that only by following him on the path of suffering will the disciples attain life and salvation. They may choose to pursue what the world loves, fame, power, and riches. But he reminds them, what profit is there for one to gain the whole world, yet lose or forfeit himself? Yes, following Jesus is costly, but paradoxically, it is also very rewarding to say the least. People will hate and reject us just like the people of Jesus' time hated and rejected him. But as Peter said, Master, to whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life. Following Jesus is life-giving. Are you afraid to follow Jesus closely because of its radical demands? Is there anything then more valuable to you than salvation and life with God forever?